Hello Artbugs, welcome back to my channel and if you are new here, big fat welcome to you too. So today I am going to share with you all a tutorial about how to create a daisy and a sunflower but in a little different and creative way. You can make it on a canvas or on a paper and decor it your room or gift it to someone. Now I will show you the essentials that I have. Half of a A4 sized handmade paper, color palette, watercolor tubes, brushes, tissue paper and two glasses of water. So let's get started. I am making a flower half of which is a daisy and rest is a sunflower. At first make a circle with compass and draw a line in the middle. Now draw the petals and the middle part of the flower with a very light pencil. In which side you want to draw the daisy, the petals have to be blunt at the edge. And for sunflowers, the petals have to be comparatively sharp. Erase the lines before applying color, else those will be visible. I am going to put names of all the colors on the screen. Take a toothpick and dip its tip in the color and make small to big dots from the middle towards the petals. Take the next color with a little amount of water and apply it on the rest of the seed part. Take the next color in the brush with some water and fill the petals with it. Now put the green as a barrier between the seed part and the petals and kind of spread it. I highlighted the seed part again with a darker color. Now the green totally differentiate the seeds and the petals. Now we'll go to the rest part of the flower, I mean the sunflower part. You need to take the color mixed with water and feel the seed part of the sunflower and let it dry. Now paint the petals of the sunflower with that yellow. Now take the same color that you used for filling the seeds with a very small amount of water and let it spread in the yellow. Now let's darken some petals. Again follow the toothpick process with the next color. Now spread some color to the petals that you have used in the seed part. Now take the next color and do some shading on the petals.
again follow the toothpick process with the next color then take the next color with water and fill the white portion of the tz part Now take the next color with water and fill the white portion of the sunflower part. Now I am using some super cheap wood color pencils from Faber Castell to do some highlighting. Now this is totally dried so I am going to peel off the masking tapes and show you the final result.